As many fans know, Haney is set to take on rising contender Ryan Garcia on April 29th in a highly anticipated showdown between two of the brightest young talents in the sport. But that mega fight is now embroiled in controversy after Garcia recently leaked damaging sparring footage of Haney getting battered by Gervonta Davis another young phenom trained by Mayweather. Haney believes Mayweather himself provided that video to sabotage his chances against Garcia as retaliation for comments made by Haney's father. Let's break down exactly what happened in this strange saga and the accusations being hurled back and forth. First, a little background. 22-year-old WBC lightweight champion Haney is considered a future pound-for-pound -pound star boasting a perfect 31-0 record and lightning-quick skills that have earned him the nickname The Dream. Garcia has a huge Instagram following and explosive knockout power, with 22 KOs among his 23 straight victories. So Haney vs. Garcia is a pay-per-view caliber matchup the whole boxing world has been eagerly anticipating. That is until that leaked footage threatened to damage Haney's chances as the likely favorite. Have a look at this footage. <laughs> The video shows Haney sparring with Gervonta Davis, Mayweather's hard-hitting protege, back at the Mayweather Boxing Club in 2017. It depicts Haney being repeatedly rocked and battered in what's clearly an eye-opening role reversal from his usual dominance. At one point, renowned trainer and former world champion Adrian Bronner even steps in to prevent a seemingly overwhelmed Haney from absorbing more punishment. Just weeks before fighting the dangerous Garcia, it was not a good look for Haney. Predictably, the clip immediately went viral after Ryan posted it on social media, raising questions about the holes it exposes in Haney's game. However, Haney himself believes there are ulterior motives at play, and placed the blame squarely on Mayweather himself. He unleashed a fiery accusation on Twitter, writing, Floyd has been hating a long time. I held my tongue for years because I respect the greats of the sport, but the dude is a bona fide hater. I don't want to see nobody win if he is not a part of it. I know he sent Ryan the sparring. I know he gave Ryan those pimp comments to say. The miserable old man tried to stop the fight. I'm happy he revealed himself to the world. Whoa! Strong words from the typically mild-mannered Haney, essentially alleging that Mayweather provided the tape to sabotage his Garcia fight out of petty jealousy. But what would prompt such charges? Well, the plot thickened when Haney's father and trainer Bill Haney further fueled speculation by referencing his own long-running feud with Mayweather. Apparently, Bill has boasted that 17-year-old Devin used to dominate a rusty 40-year-old Mayweather when they sparred during Floyd's brief 2017 comeback. Some perceive those claims as exaggerations. But Team Haney believes Floyd felt embarrassed enough that he wanted revenge by undermining Devin's rise just as his career is hitting new heights. While Mayweather has not responded publicly, Haney doubled down on his accusations, clarifying, Let's get this straight. I would never disrespect any legend that paved the way for me and many others. Floyd is a hater. Point blank, period, and it is what it is. Ima, leave it dead after this. Okay, let's analyze what's really happening here with Gloves Off's keys to victory. Motive. It's true Mayweather has faced accusations of envy towards young talents like Haney before. His reputation for pettiness means this retaliation theory can't be fully dismissed. Does he dislike rising stars eclipsing his spotlight enough to actively undermine them? Maybe so. Timing. Leaking brutal sparring footage mere weeks before Haney's biggest fight clearly appears strategically targeted to play mind games. The viral clip's immediate impact gives credence to claims it was a deliberately malicious tactic. 
deflection. However, Haney's intense reaction hints at some genuine embarrassment that shooting holes in his aura before a risky, legacy-defining match carries real consequences. He seems overly defensive, trying to deflect scrutiny of the concerning video. Unanswered questions. Critically, Haney fails to definitively prove Mayweather himself provided the tape or coaxed Ryan to post it. While the dots connect circumstantially, concrete evidence directly tying Floyd is lacking. Until more facts emerge, skepticism is warranted. So, in the end, while Mayweather's renowned jealous tendencies mean his involvement can't be ruled out, Haney likely overplayed his hand by lobbing overly emotional accusations without hard proof. He raised valid questions, but his definitive statements vilifying Floyd seemed more like defensive face-saving rather than based on confirmed facts. I suspect the truth lies somewhere in a gray area. The sparring footage may have organically leaked without clear intent to damage Haney, but conveniently turned into a useful mind game tactic Team Mayweather seized in an ends-justify-means rationale. It's not quite the overt sabotage plot Haney alleges, but it's not entirely innocent either. Regardless, the bell has been rung and the psychological warfare is now fully underway. Will the video successfully unravel Haney's focus against Garcia? Or will it instead ignite an even greater fire under Devon to prove his doubters wrong with a statement victory? One thing's for sure, tensions are flaring and the beef provides an added simmering subplot to an already red-hot matchup. On the other hand, we've also got an alarming story surrounding rising superstar Ryan Garcia. His showdown with undefeated lightweight champion Devin Haney is just over one month away. But growing concerns about Garcia's mental health now threaten to jeopardize the entire mega fight. Let's break down exactly what's happening with the latest bizarre episodes involving Ryan and analyze what it could mean for his highly anticipated matchup with Haney. First, a quick refresher. The 23-year-old Garcia has taken the sport by storm, leveraging his good looks and massive social media following into boxing stardom. With over 9 million followers on Instagram, he's dubbed himself the social media king and emerged as one of the most popular fighters of his generation. In the ring, Garcia has shown real talent too, knocking out 22 of his 23 opponents with explosive power punching. Meanwhile, his upcoming opponent, Haney, is a pure boxer with sublime technical skills who currently holds the WBC World Lightweight title that Garcia is chasing. So Ryan vs. Haney shapes up as a classic clash of styles between the veteran technician and young slugger, with the winner poised to become a household name in the post-Mayweather era. But despite all the momentum building towards April 15th, a series of bizarre incidents over the last week have raised red flags about Garcia's current mindset and stability to actually make the bout. It started at the big hype-up press conference last Monday, when Ryan appeared distracted and admitted to vices like smoking and drinking during training camp. Strange behavior, given the magnitude of the event he's preparing for. A few days later, an even more alarming series of posts appeared on Garcia's social media accounts, suggesting self-harm or suicidal references. One particularly graphic message read, We slit RG's throat and threw him in a basket. Nobody will find him. Understandably, this created hysteria among his millions of followers who feared the worst, but his father Henry soon clarified Ryan was simply trolling the wrong way. However, concerns were renewed when Garcia's ex-wife, Drea Selina, posted on Instagram over the weekend, expressing genuine worry for Ryan's well-being. He may seem fine, but he is not. I know in my heart that he is being heavily oppressed. I am genuinely concerned, and so are all his family members. We are not part of any of this, but this is real. Pray for him. Yikes. Those are not exactly reassuring words. So stay tuned, boxing fans. This story seems far from over. Will Ryan Garcia successfully tune out the noise and put his struggles behind him in time? Or are we headed for a premature implosion derailing one of boxing's most anticipated clashes? Share your thoughts on this developing saga in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more boxing drama news and analysis. Until next time, goodbye.